Do I need earrings? Something's missing, maybe some earrings. Do I need a necklace? Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I'm so excited to film this video. I think I've got some really cool stuff. Basically, I've shopped like mainly summer, like new in bits because we can now go out. We can just enjoy summer. Hopefully we can just enjoy summer to the fullest. I've got some cute little outfits. They're just the perfect summer vibe. If it reached April 12th and you was like, I haven't bought any outfits. I can't find anything. I don't know what to wear. Super affordable. There's only like one thing that I'm going to include in this haul that's like high end, but like the rest is like high street. Like I've got Zara, Bershka, ASOS, some other little like Instagram boutique places. I feel like this summer is just all about colour. It's all about like cute little dresses, cute cords. But I have got like a few little evening bits as well when we transition to going out to like bars at night. I'm so excited to wear this all and I'm so excited I can finally wear it all. I did mention in a video I filmed a whole haul, a whole try on haul about a month ago, maybe a bit longer now. And I deleted the video, so that was great. But I still have, I'm pretty sure I still have the try on clips from that video. So I'm going to insert them in this video. It might not make much sense, but I'm going to try and um, like put on the screen where the stuff is from. A lot of it was accessories, that's why there's not many like try on clips. I had like hats and little shoes. I'll insert the picture of the shoes. Literally, I just got them all off ASOS. The other try on clips are a little bit less summery. There's some like jumpers and jeans and that. But the rest of all will be very spring summer oh my gosh also the khaki dress in that try on haul is literally i think the most perfect dress i own i love it so much i've got a similar one here as well to show you but that dress is just like everything i look for in a dress if you know me on nights out like to bars and that i just usually wear a shirt dress like i just love how they look they're kind of smart casual you can dress them up you can dress them down and i feel like they complement literally any figure also my hair is like half wet half not and i had it in plaits and it was meant to be like cute beach waves but it's just not it's just not that it was so affordable so if you're looking for a new like night out bar dress nothing too fancy though you need that dress in your life Right, let's get into the haul. I'm going to start with Zara since the shirt I'm wearing is actually from Zara. This cord is also like literally one of my favourite things. Just like the material and the skirt is very Jacquemus vibes. And obviously you guys all know green is my all-time favourite colour. I love wearing green. Like if I see anything like forest green or just green coloured in general, I immediately am drawn to it. Like I have to go and check it out. Who did I see wear this on Instagram? I saw a picture of someone wearing it on Instagram and I was like, that cold is so up my street. Let me see if I can find who it was. Fern McCann. Is that how you pronounce her name? Yeah, I saw her wear it and she looks so good in it. I'll show you. It was just so cute and then I saw it was from Zara and I was like, oh my god, I need that. I got the skirt in an extra small. It's just this little green um, 
like a mini skirt it has this like wrap bit at the front that just kind of ties in like a loose knot i'm going to try everything on as well and i'll link it all down below as per usual but yeah it kind of just ties like this and you can kind of have it like higher waisted type tighter or have it kind of more low rise and then this is the shirt you'll see it on better i think i got the shirt in a small i kind of wanted it to be kind of more like puffy rather than tight but i also really want to start wearing heels this summer hence why i got a lot of like mini heels just like really tiny heels i never normally touch heels i feel like i will always be a trainer type of girl but for nights out i always struggle with footwear it was basically all in my head that i didn't want to be like towering over like when we're out and there'd be such a big height difference between me and the people i hang out with but, like now i've reached the point where i'm like I want to feel good. Heels with these outfits just make them so much cuter. They make my legs look so much nicer as well. You know, screw what anyone else thinks. My height has got me so many places. Your body's not always going to look how it looks now. So you just got to embrace it. Mini heels for this summer is what I'm going for. And white mini heels with this little cold look so cute. The top was $25.99 and the skirt was also $25.99. I love it so much and I feel like I'm going to wear it low. You can also like dress this up, up or down. I could pair it with like a pair of Air Force and it would look like a lot more casual and cooler um or obviously heels and wear it out but also like it deserves to be in italy this outfit honestly can we all just manifest that to happen this year please the other day i actually went into a zara store as well um just to have a look around they had so many nice things in there like the colors in there are insane at the moment i laid off the clothes but i did get two accessories which i'll show you first of all i got this little bag oh my god i nearly hit myself in the face i got this bag i've been wanting like a couple of new small bags i don't really have one like in this sort of size it's kind of in between small and medium which i love and it's very neutral color so it'll go with a lot of things it has this little pouch inside so that your things don't just get like lost in it and it was also in the sale it was reduced from 25.99 to 17.99 so yeah absolutely love this i feel like it's a very um summer appropriate bag and i saw these headbands on the website and i was humming and hawing about whether to get one i always love the idea of headbands and then i put them on and i'm like you don't suit that i'm gonna try and wear it um get used to them fresh out of the shower hair no problem in it like just kind of beach wave sort of vibes and this in it so this is the headband it's kind of like crocheted um but again i love the colors i thought it'd be so nice for summer the bright colors again it would look really nice if you're going away this was 11.99 so if i don't like it then i'm gonna be mad at myself i don't know okay next up we have bershka i did a massive online order on bershka again they had some really nice bits on there i saw this tiktok and it was like you need to go and like shop on bershka i'll start off with the more like evening dress so this is the khaki dress i was talking about that's very similar to the one you would have seen at the start um or is this the one okay i've really confused myself i can't remember which of the khaki dresses i showed at the start of this video i think it might be that bershka one i was about to show you so i'll show you the other one it's actually from misguided instead but i'll just show it quickly it's literally like pretty much the exact same sort of style um but it has like ties on the cuffs i literally can't remember which one i showed you yeah you can see this is the bershka one uh, they both kind of come in at the waist and have this pleated bottom but I just love the style of these I have so many black shirt dresses so I needed to switch up I don't know whether it's a mistake having literally two nearly identical khaki shirt dresses but you know if one's in the wash I can throw on the other so I got the best one in an extra small and I got the misguided one in a size six okay so moving on to the rest of Bershka I got another little cold which you will have seen from my Instagram story if you follow me on Instagram I posted a picture in it and I got lots of lovely compliments on it so yeah it's just from Bershka it's this mini checked skirt it just has like two little black buttons here and these are like fake pockets it also has a matching blazer I'm a big fan of blazers I really want to get this pink one I saw from H&M they don't have my size at the moment so i'm gonna have to wait it out but this is the matching cold one from bursk it's a cropped blazer it shows a bit of belly to break it up a little bit 
Um, but I got the blazer in a medium. I think they only had like medium or large in the blazer when I looked. But it actually fits quite nicely. I got the skirt in an extra small. And it has like an elasticated waistband at the back. So it is kind of like stretchy to your waist. But I'm thinking of pairing it with a pair of little heels or heel boots that you'll see later. I think this will look really nice with that Zara bag I showed as well. Because it's the same sort of like color the blazer was 27.99 and the skirt was 19.99 the rest of this stuff from vershka i haven't tried on yet it's going to be a first impression for all of us when i show the trial clips um, but next i got this bright green dress like kind of cut out um mini dress i don't really have a dress like this but it looked really nice on the model um, I don't know whether this is going to look great on me. I don't really like my arms. I have this weird thing, like I don't like showing bare arms with clothes. I don't know, I have this weird thing and this is going to be a lot of arms and a lot of legs. So I'm not sure how I want to feel about it. I got it in a size extra small. I think it could like really complement your figure though with these cutouts. This was $27.99 as well. Next up, I have a pair of just casual shorts. I love like boy style shorts. You you know like the these like jogger three quarter ones they're just so comfy so easy to throw on with like a sweatshirt i have a pair in gray i have a pair in pink and i thought these were really cute like the rainbow at the bottom they kind of have it like piping down the side and then around the bottoms of them i don't particularly love the writing it says sassy angel like it's a bit i don't really like the word sassy i've never really liked that word but it's in like a cute font and colors so we'll look past it and i got these in a size extra small these were 17.99 they also had a matching jumper which looked really cute with the shorts but again it just had like sassy in massive letters on the front of it i thought like that's oh my god did you just see that that was Another dress from Bershka. I I don't really think I have anything in this colour. It's literally like a bright... Oh my god, I didn't even see the back. <gasps> that is so cute. So it's kind of like a cut out back. And then it kind of ties like a corset. And it's kind of got like a corset cinched waist detail. Yeah, I don't have any dresses like in this sort of colour. Very bright and summery. I'm not sure if I'm going to love the low kind of v-neck. I do love like a... I love like a buttoned up neck moment. I guess this one's kind of low as well, so maybe I will like it. But the shape looked really cute. It's something different for summer for me. I got this in an extra small as well. And this was $29.99. With gold jewellery, I think this dress will look so cute. The last thing I got from Bershka was a pair of trousers. I don't know whether these are going to be a bit short for me. They also look a tiny bit see-through. I don't know how many times I'm going to say Jacquemus vibe, but they are. They're like that linen-y, um, off-white sort of colour. They're really lightweight. Maybe like a cute little crochet top. Or like beach trousers with a bikini top. I just thought these were very like summer appropriate because they're super like airy and lightweight. They're not tight at all. I thought these in a size 6. They're in the colour sand and they were $25.99. The next place I ordered from is actually somewhere called um, Shop Cider. I literally just saw it on Instagram because I saw a girl wearing one of these jumpers. You know, these like really cute, like kind of Pinterest um, heart jumpers. And they had lots of different colors. They had it in blue, red, green. I felt like there was another color. Oh, and brown. They were all like so nice, but obviously i went for the green it kind of gave me like matcha vibes and i didn't know what to expect of the quality because it was pretty reasonably priced i think they're based in hong kong um i didn't know if it'd be like really cheap quality but the quality of this jumper is so nice it's so like silky soft you can't tell on the camera you have to be here to feel it but i absolutely love it it looks so nice with brown jeans and i got it in a size large because everyone was saying they come up a bit big um but for a size large i think this is pretty small so if you want it like really oversized i say get like quite a few sizes up i kind of wish i got a size bigger but i think it'll be nice for next autumn as well i'm not sure about this dress i don't know how i feel about it it's kind of very milkmaid and young looking it's this blue checked 
like off the shoulder i don't know if it's off or on the shoulder dress it has this like stretchy ruched part it is very sweet it could be cute for a picnic that heart jumper was 25 pound 51 prices are so weird and this dress was £18.95 next from that shop cider place is this top I don't like this top so I probably won't try it on because I'm going to sell it if you are interested in buying this top it'll probably be on my depop at some point so I head over there but it's just not my style I don't know I just don't think it really suits me but it is a super nice top it's this kind of olivey green tight knit top these are sort of very in style it kind of just ties at the front here I've seen other girls look so good in them but I just personally don't think my style bell sleeves they're really cute I got that in a size small lastly from that shop is this little corset top with light blue jeans i think it would look really cute but it kind of feels a bit cheap um like the straps are literally just like normal ribbon you could get from like hobby craft and um, you just tie them over your shoulder so it does feel a little bit cheap um but i just loved the colors in this very spring appropriate and it has like a ruched stretchy back detail it is a really sweet top to pair with jeans with the shop side orders you also get these really cute stickers um like just in with the order this isn't like sponsored or anything but we're getting there so from pretty little thing i just got a couple of bits i got one of these knit cowards i don't really have anything in this kind of cobalt is it cobalt blue so i've got this little knit cardigan crop knit cardigan and the matching cycling shorts just kind of comfy loungewear but make it cute that was a cute little cold i got the cardigan in a medium and that was 16 pounds and the shorts in a size small and they were 10 pound 50 and I also just got another pair of cycling shorts. These are slightly different material. They're really soft and like stretchy, comfy material. And they're kind of like khaki, olive colour. Again, just to lounge about in or do a quick workout in. I got these in a size extra small slash small. They're in the colour sage green and they were £13. I also placed an order on lounge underwear. I have been wanting to get my hands on this underwear for the longest time. I'm sure all you girls know it. It's not the cheapest underwear brand, which is why I was like kind of put off for a while. Um, and then the other month they had a sale. So I decided, you know what? I'm just gonna treat myself. It's just nice to have some nice underwear, treat yourself, makes you feel good. And I'm so obsessed with all the colors they have on there. I got two sets. One of them's actually in the wash kind of one of the more relaxed loungy sets it was like a mesh khaki green set the material was so nice it's like soft and it's not velvet but it's really smooth and just so comfortable i really recommend these sets because they are genuinely really nice quality and really comfy and then the second one i got was their classic i think these are just like the balcony bras i think this is in the color emerald obviously i had to get green like look how pretty they are i think this is like the best fitting underwear i have there's nothing that digs in the um band is super like comfy and stretchy and they just fit so well and then i got the matching knickers they're just these um again such nice detailing and they have like a really nice stretchy um high-waisted waistband which i absolutely love so yeah if you are looking to treat yourself to new underwear i really recommend looking on there the penultimate thing i have to show you and the last high street brand is asos it's actually a pair of boots so i've been after a pair of like knee-high boots with a really small heel for the longest time but i want them stiff but wide if that makes sense like not tight to my leg basically they look structured but wide i can't find the price of them but they were like 50 pounds but they were reduced from about 100 um i'm not even sure what brand these are oh they're literally just asos design they had a really small heel i don't want anything too high um and they are wide leg the only thing about these is that they're a little bit shorter than what i want them it's probably just because i have like super long legs but i kind of want them at my knee or a tiny bit above and i have like a square toe as well i'd love to just get a pair of staple boots um that i love and the last thing is not really summer related but i went to vista the other day and i thought i'd show you what i got i actually treated myself to 
a new coat from Prada. I don't really own designer stuff. If I have anything designer, it's more like accessories, like bag, shoes, or jewelry. I don't really have designer clothes. So I'm having a little moment. I'm like, oh, was it worth it? Obviously, we're going into summer now, but I saw this coat and I was obsessed with it. If you know me, I love oversized clothes and this was from the men's section. It's in this gorgeous brown color and it's like an oversized puffer. I'm so excited to wear it when it like, obviously I'm not wishing for cold weather because I hate the cold weather. I need a good coat that keeps me warm, especially when I go on like locations with my job. I want to make sure I'm wrapped up and warm and I just thought, this coat will keep me warm. It will last me like a lifetime. And it's in like a really nice colour. It fits how I'd want it to fit. So it's just this big brown. It has a little Prada badge on the sleeve. Um, and a big hood. I think that pretty much concludes this haul. I hope this helps you guys out. You're getting your cute summer outfits ready for June 21st. I'm literally going out for the first time for a meal tomorrow. And I could cry. I'm so excited i'm obsessed with everything i've got hopefully you guys can take some like inspiration see what's new in at these high street stores from this video thank you so much for watching this video i really hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you in my next one bye